Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, guys, wherever you are on this beautiful world, whenever you're watching this video, welcome to the Bitcoin family uh, channel, guys. For the newcomers, my name is Didi, yes, the guy that still says goodbye to the banks and buy Bitcoin, guys. In today's video, talking about uh, the news, a massive article uh, that's going to influence uh, cryptocurrencies and virtual assets in the whole, a big, big, big time. Also talking about the trading chart, also giving you a trading tip, also give you a travel tip, and also maybe share something else. I was making a beautiful walk and talk video there in the in the beautiful nature, but the wind is massive over there, so I need to go here behind my house, then I'm protected of the wind. I will keep it short and powerful because yesterday, yeah, we came home late from uh, they had the Banyo, you know, the, the, the beautiful festival in Praia de Luz. Uh, we had three stages with a lot of good music, dancing and fun uh, all together, guys. Now, the first thing today is not going to be a chart. The first thing is going to be that massive news. And after that, I will go into the charts, guys. That massive news is very important. The news is that Twitter just acquired, sorry, X just acquired the license to be able to work with virtual assets in to their platform so they are going to integrate virtual assets in their platform that's why they acquired the license i wouldn't know else why you would require or acquire a license guys uh, this is massive news this is what i've been talking about already for years the moment we will combine social media with virtual assets like bitcoin that is the moment there will be a shift in the monetary system because people expect simplicity of use when it comes to monetary values they want to have a simple use case of it like if they want to use money it needs to be something they can have in their pocket or use with an app you know it needs to be simple so the moment we want to have bitcoin as a as a currency a legal tender all over the world uh, it needs to be simple for everyone including your grandma to use and that is now going to happen because if x will give that like get that license to be able to transact virtual assets in their platform other social media platforms will probably get as well and that means that the simplicity is coming closer and closer and closer because just imagine that your grandmother has an X account and she's called Super Granny. And from Super Granny account, she wants to send a little bit of pocket money to you. Uh, allowance, let's call it like that. Allowance in Bitcoin. And then she just needs to look to your profile, click send, uh, select the amount, and that's all. Uh, that is the simplicity of Bitcoin. And that is the moment when she and all the other elderly people will start to use cryptocurrencies and all of virtual assets guys so there's an amazing step for cryptocurrency guys i think it's going to have a huge influence in the adoption when it comes to crypto massive news bam and then of course there's the second bullish news the second bullish news guys is that the sec lost their lawsuit against grayscale grayscale at the end is the winner when it comes to getting an approval for a spot etf they already applied for this two years ago when they wanted to do their fund and exchange that and change that fund into a spot etf it was denied every time and again and again and again now yesterday um, grayscale won the lawsuit against the sec hashtag fire gary gensler hashtag fire gary gensler hashtag fire gary gensler <laughs> he will be fired man fuck off he's he's stopping evolution of technology so uh, you can never get you can never hold your job when you stop the evolution of technology guys so um grayscale one this is one step closer to an official spot etf for bitcoin in the united states uh, probably maybe even i saw some news articles stating that ah, it will only take one or two weeks before the spot etf will launch which will mean all the institutional investors finally get a safe way to start to buy bitcoins in a spot etf at grayscale let's see if this is going to happen uh, the massive news was already pumping the price yesterday almost with 1500 us dollar that doesn't even mean that the spot edf is already there just imagine what the pump will be if that spot edf will be approved for gay scale for blackrock for fidelity for all of those that already have been applying for spot ETFs for years if that all will get approved and then also twitter will start to implement beautiful transactions of bitcoin oh my god then this bull then this bull run could be a massive 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 bull run yes and then i expect definitely prices above 100k maybe even nearing 200k guys but that will be in 2025 now that was all the news for today 
them. And that massive lose leads to some very uh, interesting thoughts because um, everything in life is impossible until it's done. That's a very beautiful quote. Everything is impossible until it's done. Just imagine, I know for a fact that if you look back in history, Elon Musk already uh, registered the, the, dom the domain name X a long time ago. And the intention of X at that moment was to become a new financial platform. At that moment, the technology was not there, the possibilities were not there. At that moment, everyone thought it was impossible. Even Elon Musk gave up that dream in the beginning because he thought it would be impossible. Luckily, he became smarter and smarter and smarter. And at the end, he thought, no, nothing is impossible till it's done. And that is now happening. It was impossible until it's done. And it's done now. X acquired a beautiful license to be able to interact with virtual assets in their platform. And it was impossible till it was done. And there is millions of examples that you daily think of. Ah, no, that must be impossible. Ah, no, that must be impossible. Ah, no, that's really impossible. And I think that is impossible. No, it's all impossible until you do it. You just do it. Then you make it possible. And then when you make it possible, everyone will start to believe it is possible it was impossible to sell your house with bitcoins it is possible now it was impossible to travel the world solely with bitcoins it is possible now everything is impossible until you do it now that was the advice for today guys now let's quickly jump into uh, two amazing charts then a beautiful trading tip and maybe some special travel advice that you would need for your next trip bam Today I have two amazing charts. This is the first chart, guys. And this is not a chart from the current moment, but this is a chart from the 2016 to 2018 bull run. And I want to share this chart with you so that you understand that during a bull run, we still can have these tiny crashes. And I say tiny, but these crashes are like 38%, 38%, 33%, 38%, 36%, 29%. These crashes, they just happen during bull runs. And it is always to do with the emotional stages of uh, the traders, guys. Yes, when Bitcoin pumps, there needs to be a small correction. The pump will be bigger than the correction. Just like the trading tips I gave you, the winners will be bigger than the losses. So, yes... Uh, we pump and then we can dump a little bit, uh, but that means that doesn't mean that the bull market is over. Just look at here, 2017, how many uh, huge pumps we had and small uh, dumps we had of 38%. I'm saying small dumps because the pumps were way bigger than uh, that 38% crash or dip or whatever you call it so just be prepared that also in the next bull run yes we will have some massive rallies and you will find uh, yourself in euphoric stages and yes then uh, we will have some prices dipping again and you will be uh, in a very negative stage but those dips are there to buy that is why everyone says on uh, twitter that's why everyone says in social media buy the dip when it dips you dollar cost average into Bitcoin. Now, second chart that I want to share with you is this one by uh, Plan B. Very interesting chart because um, the dark blue is a two-year realized price. The black is the realized cost price. And the light blue is a five-month realized. So it's a short-term holder. Now, and then the dots, that is the Bitcoin price, guys. As you can see, after every bear market... These dots are playing around with that blue line. I'm talking about the dark blue line. Uh, we sir uh, Plan B circled all of these moments, but just look at those moments. It never went massively directly up and above that blue line. It was always fighting that blue line. The first time, completely to the left in 2012, it was fighting the blue line before it took a distance. The second time in 2016 there, it was fighting that blue line before it took a distance. Then now the third time there in 2020, those red dots were fighting that blue line before it took a distance. And now again, guys, we can see the same. This time is not different when it comes to this structure. The dots went above the blue line. They're fighting the blue line. There will be a dance around the two-year realized price. And when we break that line, 
we move above it we take a distance and that is when the bull market is fully on and for me that moment will be after the halving in 2024 april but let's see guys let's see maybe this bullish news that we just saw and um, will pump the price a little bit more early than that halving guys now that were the only two charts for today uh, let's jump into the next part bam Hope you enjoyed those chart guys. Now uh, the trading tip for the day is very powerful. Of course, always powerful tips, GD. Um, the trading tip is that you must never fall in love with an asset or a stock. Also not with a cryptocurrency. Never fall in love with the cryptocurrency. Yes, you can fall in love with Bitcoin as you believe in a store of value, a long-term perspective, but that's not a trader. That's just a hodler. And a hodler can fall in love with it. With it. But even me as a hardcore hodler, if Bitcoin will reach the top, I will exchange it for stable coins, of course, to take some profit. But if it's a day trader, you know, or a swing trader, it's very important that you never fall in love with a cryptocurrency asset or other stock, guys don't get emotionally attached to that it is there to make you profit because that's why you call yourself a trader and if you're a trader you need to make profits and you only can only make profits if you're not emotionally attached to an asset it must be simple for you to sell it yes you might love the community yes you might love the people behind it yes you might love everything else about the cryptocurrency but when you're in profit you take your profit never fall in love with an asset that was a trading tip for today bam and then now guys a very important travel tip i think it's one of the most important travel tips nowadays guys if you travel and you reach these beautiful destinations that you always dreamt of yes of course make beautiful pictures make a beautiful story make a beautiful reel uh, make beautiful videos whatever you want to do on that moment that you reach that ultimate dream location but also always be able to put down your camera and immerse completely in the situation. Feel the situation, feel the situation in a natural way without a lens. You know the situations where you've been filming, 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 and then you just come to really enjoy the moment because you were just too focused on that perfect reel, that perfect story, that perfect picture. Sometimes you need to put away the camera and enjoy that moment to the fullest through your own eyes and not through the lens of your telephone or camera that was the travel tip of today i hope you really enjoyed today's video if you did enjoy today's video then please give this video a thumbs up share with your friends and family subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell and leave a comment yes nothing about um, that i drank yesterday and that my voice is a little bit different just comment about the charts and my tips thanks for watching guys i wish you an amazing wednesday and yes bitcoin pumped of course beautifully let's see if we can go up to 30k because of all the news that we saw yesterday today. Damn.